If you are a lover of good deeds, let me bring you this story which might put a smile on your face tonight. It's a story of a young man helping less privileged persons through his skill. That's barbering or shaving if you like. A.K. Walters Ngale gives free haircuts to children who can't afford one and derives joy in putting a smile on their faces. As you will see in this report, uniting barbers across Cameroon also remains an important desire for him. This isn't your ordinary barber's appointment. It's a competition for hairstylists to display their skills and talent. This is Baba's short down boy. These young men are drawn from different parts of the country and are putting in all their know-how to grab the prize. But they're also out to have some fun. So too are the ladies who carve out different styles on the heads of their volunteers. Behind the initiative is this man, A.K. Walters Ngale, popularly known as Walcott's the Baba. It's all part of his project to unite barbers in Cameroon and make them cooperate even more. If there's one more thing that makes him stand out, it's his love for the community. Walters is a humanitarian hairstylist who makes it his duty to put a smile on the faces of less privileged children as well as internally displaced persons. When he's not attending to customers, he's often on the road, touring different localities and giving children like these free haircuts. He pours out his heart and sweat for the kids as his own way of giving back to the community. I got into the game through the community. So it was the community that introduced me to the game and then uh, gave me the, the, the training for free. So that is why, that is why I'm actually giving the, my services back to the community for free. As huge as people see his gesture, Walters still has even larger dreams for the future. Very simple, start a barbing institution, a barbing institution that is going to be free for the less privileged and for the prisoners and um, for the people, like um, those who are actually youths that are actually trying to fit themselves into the community. Barbers here might be having fun doing what they love, but the person who brought them here together is making an impassioned plea to them. They should know that they are community builders and they should do more to the community because the community is actually giving them more. Understand the gold. Uh, I think they are, help, they are not helping the community because they are paying them to come to have it. So I, 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 I pray that and I, I'm telling them that they should actually put more and help the community one way or the other. Walters leaves each day hoping to get fulfillment from the number of lives he continues to impact. A wish which, according to many, already seems overly achieved by what he's done so far.